Let's talk physics, specifically motion and inertia. Imagine you're on a smooth train ride. The train is moving at 100 miles per hour, but if the ride is steady, you don't feel like you're moving. Only when the train accelerates, decelerates, or turns do you feel that whoa moment in your body. That sensation comes from a change in velocity. But if nothing's changing, if the movement is constant and smooth, you feel nothing. This is called Newton's first law of motion, or the law of inertia. It says, an object in motion will stay in motion unless acted upon by an outside force. Right now, everything around you, the air, your chair, your cat, your body, is spinning with the earth at the same constant speed. There's no sudden jerk, no change in direction. So, your body doesn't notice it. You're in motion, but it's steady, and your senses don't care. But what about wind? Shouldn't there be some kind of earth spin breeze? Excellent question. If the earth is spinning over 1,000 miles per hour, shouldn't we feel wind blasting in our faces like a high-speed fan? Not quite, because the atmosphere is spinning too. When the earth formed, it dragged its atmosphere along with it. So the air above you is rotating with the earth at the same speed. It's all moving together as one massive synchronized system. That's why you don't feel a thousand miles per hour headwind every time you go outside. Okay, but what if the earth suddenly stopped spinning? Ah, now that you'd feel. Everything on the surface would suddenly fly eastward at insane speeds. It'd be like being thrown out of a car going 1,000 miles per hour. Cities would crumble, oceans would flood inland, basically the worst day ever. 